Hi, I'm Peter Kalmström of Kalmström.com Business Solutions. In this demonstration, I will show you how to import documents and folders into a document library in SharePoint Online using SharePoint Designer 2013. First of all, I'm going to copy the link to the site, and then I'm going to start SharePoint Designer. And then I'm going to open the site, paste the link that I just copied. And of course, I need to fill in my username then. There we go. Now I'm logged in. Open that. Now, under List and Libraries, you'll see the document libraries that you have there, for example, Documents. But if you click in on that, you'll only see the properties of that document library. To see the actual files, you need to go into All Files, find the document library, which is actually called Shared Documents here, as we see. And there you see all the files in that document library. You also see the hidden folder forms. You can just ignore that for now. Here you have the import files where you can add specific files, or you can even add folders here. So I'm going to do add some folders. So I'll go into my documents here, and there are some folders. So I'm going to add these folders. I'm going to start by images and videos. And as you see, uh, not only the folder, but all subfolders got to add it there also. And all the files, of course, also. So the logos, for example, got included there. And the same thing I'm going to do with the people pack there. And all those files and subfolders and, well, everything got included there. So finally, the Visio one. And then I'm going to add the files from here, the root. I'm going to add all those two. And I did that by clicking on the first one and then holding down the Shift key on the keyboard and clicking on the, la on the last one. So there, I now have all the files and all the folders that I want to import. I'm going to click OK, and now that starts happening in the background here. You see the folders have already been created. So let's go back to the web uh, interface and look at that. I refresh the page, and there are indeed my folders and the files being imported. In general, I feel that this is a more stable way of doing it when you're importing lots of files as, as compared to drag and drop, and also as compared to opening with Windows Explorer, which might be buggy, to say the least. And I also, I haven't really tested this, but I also think that it's faster. But more stable is an important thing to consider. So that concludes my demo on how to import files into a SharePoint document library using SharePoint Designer 2013. Thank you for watching this demonstration.